Hi guys, happy Memorial Day weekend to you. Whatever you've got planned this weekend, I hope you have a nice time. I plan on staying in and uh, throwing some paint around, hopefully, if my cats will allow it. But whatever you do, have a nice time. So last week I did a piece using these Artist Loft ready to pour paints. Um, and I used a split cup from Tracy Reed. This week I wanted to uh, do a pour just layering a regular cup. Not everybody has a split cup. Um, and I wanted to show that you can get some really great results with these paints, um, just doing a regular layered cup. So we're layering this nine ounce cup. The canvas is a 12 by 16, and we're gonna do uh, just a regular straight pour and see what we can get. noticed that I did not use a base coat or um, a puddle to start pouring the paint into. I have learned the hard way a couple of times that this paint does not like to be left thick on the canvas. Um, so that is why I don't use a paint underneath it. I don't want to make it too thick and uh, I usually tilt it pretty hard uh, to try and get as much off as I can because nobody likes cracks in your painting. Is it just me or is there something extremely gratifying about watching those lines open up? It never fails to amaze me when I see lines like that opening up, creating depth, staying sharp. It is just the most gorgeous thing I've ever seen.
this piece was actually an attempt of mine to duplicate a pour that I did a few months ago when I had a class with some kids and I did a pour like this to demonstrate to them what the colors were going to look like together, um, kind of how to pour the cup. And uh, I wasn't able to bring it home because I didn't take a box or anything to bring it home in. So I left it there with them. I don't know how it dried, but um, this is a picture of what it looked like after I poured it wet. So I thought I did pretty good in uh, duplicating the center. The outer colors are a little bit different, but um, first time I've actually ever almost perfectly duplicated a piece because as you guys know, that is really hard to do in this art form. The dried results of this piece were just as pretty as the wet results. Dried absolutely perfectly. I love, love these colors together. I haven't poured a bad painting yet using these colors together. They are just so complimentary, bright, vibrant, happy, warm colors. Um, I love the 3D look of those lines. And uh, I don't know, I'm just enjoying these paints. I want to thank you for being here. As always, any time that you spend with me is very much appreciated. Be sure and like the video. Um, leave me a comment if you would, and tell me what you think of this piece. Or if there's another type of pour that you'd like to see with these paints, I would be happy to oblige you. Now, go have fun with your weekend, be safe, and I will see you soon.